Recently, I was asked by a viewer to look at this problem. How hard is it to replace the battery between the Braun and the Icon 800 Lumen rechargeable slim bar light? They have a Braun Legacy Harbor Freight slim light, which is I think 390 lumen or 300 lumen. It is really well built with an aluminum body. It has taken a beating. Mine specifically has fallen off scaffolding, has fallen off ladders, and it works perfectly fine. No issue at all. It does have the older USB plug in there. Micro USB. It does not have any type of indicator of how the battery is doing as it, as it decharges, right? This light right here is kind of too simplistic. It just goes from green to red. It doesn't really tell you much. Now, this is one of the things right here that makes this Braun light loved by so many. You just unscrew it and now you can go ahead and get a new 18650 cell. Stick it in there and just screw it back on. That option has made this the number one choice when people shop at Harbor Freight. Now this icon here actually can fold all the way down, which is great. Now the Braun does have a newer model that allows that, but this is the old daddy here. It has an LED here and it has an LED in the back which is really cool for double LED. There's also an LED at the tip. It has nice button action there and it tells you how the battery is doing as it drains. It has USB-C, which is awesome. Now the new Braun lights, the new, the new ones that are coming out have the same thing. But should you upgrade to this, especially when your concern is replacing the battery? Let's go ahead and see what that looks like. I'm gonna go ahead and shut it off and we're going to go ahead and remove this battery. Here's the challenge. If you want to replace this cell, you're going to have to get one with this wiring and connector. But if you don't want to do that, you could still get an old cell and cut this and weld this wiring or splice this wiring and weld it to the other battery so that you keep that connector. But you're only going to be able to do that so many times before you ruin this wire. So they really have made it harder for you to just replace the battery, almost like they want you to get it from them or they want you to buy a brand new light. It looks like this JS2 connector is proprietary, especially with its big clamp at the end. If I'm wrong, please put it in the comments, but let me know where I can get a replacement. For now, I can give you a suitable replacement in the video and you can go ahead and modify it to fit that housing 